Hey, what's up, family? What's up? Gonna. Hey, fam. What's up, everybody? Fam, bam, in the building. Hey, welcome to living my best life in Ghana. Let me get my light on. What's up, y'all? Hey. Oh, it's so cool to be from Africa now. Yes, yes, yes. Hey, family. What's up, y'all? Welcome to Living My Best Life in Ghana. Yes. Eat your heart out. We going home. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, <laughs> Ooh. so happy. I am so happy. Our time is dwindling on down. Many of us are very excited about going home. The bug is felt. Everybody is feeling this calling from the ancestors like never before. It's just so exciting. It's so exciting. Yes, my sister, uh, Yah from the Sankofa Repatriation uh assistance program she made her debut back in ghana i'm happy for my sister yes everybody is getting their sales back home to the motherland it is our time it's time for us to go what a great time to be african happy africa day to you me and all of us how great is it to be african it's just amazing it's amazing Okay, it's just a great day to be African. It's a great day to know who you are, to know your purpose, to know how well we fit in this puzzle as African people, understanding our power. All we got to do is be consistent, have some perseverance, some self-love, some self-esteem, some self-worth, some self-preservation. And we showing that by throwing that, throwing out the towels, throwing up the towels. We getting up out of here. Okay. We doing our day to let them stay here and, and label their own stuff. Okay. It's time to go home. What's up family. Let me see who we got up in the building. I ain't going to hesitate. Hold it back. I'm excited about today's subject. What's up my Joe family. Cheryl, the first one in the house tonight. What's up with your cousin. Virginia Harris, uh, Auntie from California. Good evening to the Limblig family. Hey, Auntie, Miss Grace, what's up with you? A choir by family. Miss Grace, you're doing it big on the packing situation. We love what you're doing. You has been a great example of packing. Marie Antoinette, a choir by family. Yo, Marie. Sao Bona. Yes. Hey, Marie. Yes. Touching that thumbs up button in my way in. I'm living my best life. I ain't going back and forth. My joy, yo. Hey, y'all. Hey, Prince Quasi. What's up with you? Good evening, everyone. Hey, good evening, yo. Leg. What's up with you? All right. <laughs> greetings, 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 Limb League family. Did you smash the like button on your way in? Becoming my art. Right. True, justice, righteousness, reciprocity, harmony, balance, and divine order, baby. All day, baby. Yes. Ain't nothing gonna stop us. Ain't nothing stopping us now. Why? We on the move. You hear me? We got our lurkers thumbs down already. Ain't that some? It's all right. It's just the lurkers be doing their job. All right. There is too much positivity going on over here. They can't take it. They can't take it, y'all. Uh-huh. What's up? Hey, everybody. Greetings, Queen. Annette Lewis is in the house. Hey, Marie Antoinette. My joy, African family. I hit the like button already. Blind got his wife in their life in the building. Yes. Hey, there. Everybody's speaking. Hey, future, yo, leg. Hey, sister, what's up with it? It's so cute. Hey, Stephanie. Hey, my love. What's up, my sisters? All my sisters and my bro bros here. What's up, Prince Quasey? 
Aquaba family, Yaya Bay is in the building. Hey, Yaya Bay, going to Africa and I'm acting up. Marie Antoinette is going to Africa. We'll be acting up together, okay? Evening family, hey, future Jackie C is in the house. Hey there, I got some Cameroon and me too. Oh, <laughs> that is awesome, awesome. Queen Mermaid, hey sis. Hey, Queen Mermaid. Who is this Queen Mermaid in the house of water? Yes, this Mommy Water. That's Mommy Water, okay? That's where they get that from, Queen Mermaid. That's Mommy Water. Hey, Felicia Brown. Greetings, family. Peace and love. Hey, Felicia. My habit is in the house. Yo, my habit, what's up with you? Marie Antoinette said, come in with the like bu button, family. Sure, and come in right quick. Go ahead and handle it. Maki Dada, pa. Hey, family, I'm here ready for this combo. Okay, Tony Kwame Key. Tony Kwame Key to the whole of Africa. What's up with you, bro, bro? Hey, fam, what's up, everybody? Hello, Aquaba, Aquaba, Aquaba. Audrey, yo, what's up with ya? Hey, fam, Bawoni, Abeyadi, yo, the white the mentor. Man, we enjoyed that live with you earlier, bro, bro. Can't wait to get you on here again. My brother be dropping it so fast on us, boy. We got to watch it over and over and over and over and over again. Auntie Wendy, what's up with your greetings? E, great evening, everyone. One Africa. Yes, Auntie. Good evening, Royal Family. Greetings, uh, Queen Future and King Power. Hey, Maud Kelly is in the building. What's up with y'all? What's up with your family? Hey, Shannon Joy Aquaba. Hey, Shannon, I don't know what was over the phone today, but it was raining all day, so that might have something to do with it. Let's hook up tomorrow, my love. Yes, everyone is here speaking, spending time with each other. Hey, everybody, in my Jaja voice, definitely looking forward to tonight's topic. Miss Miller Snow to Pop One. Hey there. Yes, hey from California, Queen Mermaid is in the house. Much love, Aquaba, Aquaba. Welcome to the live. We appreciate you being a part of our family here. Make yourself comfortable. Everybody's going to make you feel comfortable. Let's build together. We are building families here and living my best life in Ghana. Yes, no doubt we'll be there in one year. Okay. Yes, I hope you can hold out that long, Queen Mermaid. But hey, congratulations. It's good saying it. And who knows what the ancestors got in store for you, okay? Mind, body, Africa. Blessings from the NYC. What's up, mind, body, Africa? I love your logo. It's beautiful. It says it's just showing a whole lot right there, okay? Majo, Yoli. Okay. Yes, everybody's. Speaking to everyone. Peace and love, everybody. Everyone's area is in the house. Hey, love. Yes, representing Mommy Wata. Okay, we got Mommy Wata in the building now. Don't play with her. Greetings, everyone. In my WH Boutique is here. Your presence is felt. Keisha! Keish, Keish is in the house. And Keith, too. One is the other, the other is one. They are one. Keisha, what's up? Aquaba, Lim Blig family. Okay, Sawabona. Yes, love the lies you have with us. Yes, the white. Wait for me, wait for me. Here I come, family. Hey, 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 hey. The savvy entrepreneur is in the house. What's up, sis? Hey, family, I'm here in the house. Didn't get my notification, but I got Miss Grace alarming in the soft talk. Greetings, little baby sis. Go on, Sonya. Hey, Sonya. That's right. That's what we do. The Quabai family back again for my positive vibe fix. Bill Lauren, you can do whatever you will, Bill. Okay? Handle your business. And Jafrika, blessings be you, T4, Limblick family. Y'all make my night love your energy queen. 
Love you too. Right back at you. I attack, I receive it and I give it right, right back. Burst. Bursts of love all over the place for black people. Okay. African people deserve some love and some peace and some respect and some freedom and some good feeling for a change. Okay. Without no strings attached, nothing slick with it. Just pure, clean, African natural love. You hear me? That's right. That's right. Hey, family, love you all. Sending virtual hugs. Alexis Gates is in the house. Hey. Go on, y'all. Speak to each other then. A quab out to my beautiful Lim Blig fam and Queen Future. It was a pleasure talking to you today, Sonovia. Yes, much love to the family. I'm waiting on all my other phone calls. Y'all call. Yeah, hey. Future is right here. Sonia Crawford Brinkley re really enjoyed our brother Dwight the mentor. Very informative and well spoken. Don't he just I told him I had to bring him on every two weeks or something. I got to get a regular schedule up out of my bro, bro. Okay. David Ukpo Koklo, a quaba, beautiful people. Hey, David. How you doing, love? Salute, Queen Future. Bam, T Roy. Hey, my bro, bro. Much love to y'all, a quaba, beautiful African people. All right. Much love. Charles Kelly. Is in the house. All right, keep doing your thing. I will do it. Your picture sideways, but hey, bro, much love to you. Thank you for being here. It's good meeting you and seeing you on the live. And we building right here. Make sure you make yourself at home. Hey, it's time for us to go home to Africa, baby. Smash that like button, family, right now. T Roy said. All right. Our moderators are on here. I thank y'all so much. Thank our moderators for being loyal to Limb League family. Always here, keeping the live clean, keeping our uh, trolls out, watching the, the chat, as well as making all our new family members feel at home. Welcome to all our new subbies. Much love to you. Much love to our new family members, our OGs, our regular regulars, and everything in between. We love y'all. Thank you so much. All right, all these hugs going on around here. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Jezera Musa, so bona limblig. Yo, yes, Den Wadre, Den Le, welcome and greetings. Welcome to living my best life in Ghana. Yes, Infinite Mama Folk, Infinite Mama Folk, greetings, family, sister, future. These topics always on point. What a blessing to have the Limblig family. Okay, just some things we've been learning. We want to make sure everybody had a little tools and gems and everything to make things happen. My job, because I know a lot of our people been asking about the one-way trip, how you can get past that when you want to buy one way. Breonna Taylor is a wake-up call. Is it really? We been got that wake-up call. We cannot protect ourselves here. Okay? It's still some wake-ups that has to happen, though. So you right, Dwight. No problem. Mm-hmm. I am not surprised. Rio Sankofa. Yo, Aquaba Queen. Much love to you, Rios. Aquaba. Yes, make Dwight a monthly updater. Enjoyed listening to him today, didn't we? Now, I hope y'all went over and subscribed to his channel. Okay. Getting on to my brother. You know, he got some nice content over there. He's a film director, producer. Oh, the location thing. I can't wait to work with him, okay, on some things. Uh, I'm looking forward to all of this. My job, fam. Watching y'all while I so Gucci pillars for a client. Bro's going to work it out. Brother's going to work it out, Jaton. You better do it. Go on, Jaton. That sister is crafty with her hands. I heard about your sweet potato pie, too. I had to hear about that. I think we did talk about that before, but somebody said they had tasted some of your pie. And that was uh, BL, my sister, our new sister uh, up in here. Yeah, she told us how good that sweet potato pie was, uh, Jaton. We heard about that now. Mikey Dada, the white man. 
Ah, oh, mentor. I watched the live earlier and you dropped so much knowledge and helpful tips with people like you and this fam. We would definitely make home, won't we? Mikey Dada. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. We're working on some more of the Limblig family. Come on here with some jewels. Okay, my flight was canceled, so I had to get another one, but I got I get to spend 22 hours in Ethiopia. I'm gonna miss the hell out of that day. LOL. I'm not mad at all. T Roy. That's what I'm talking about. Country hopping without even doing it on purpose. Oh, I love it. Yes. That's beautiful. Kutama umpendo wangu. Tell me what it means, sis. Come on with it. Acquired by my beautiful African family. Drum roll. <laughs> Effective immediately. I am now proud to announce 99.70 Balanta people from Guinea Bissau and Mandinka people from Senegal. <laughs> Malika. Oh, I know who I am. Go, Malika. I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy for you. That is awesome. Oh, Malika, you've been waiting patiently on your test results, African ancestry, baby. Oh, my goodness. That's beautiful. Balanta people from Guinea-Bissau and Mandinka people from Senegal. Look, got your paperwork now, Malika. It's time to go get your citizenship, baby. Show lives. Earrings, future. Wow. Yes, you see that? I represent a little red and I'm the black. And then I got the green on this side. Okay. Red, black, and green representation, baby. All day, every day. Africa first. Greetings, free Sandra Blackburn. Greetings, my love. Aquaba. Welcome to living my best life in Ghana, where we are killing all negative and evil stereotypes about African people, our motherland our relationships, our heritage, our tribes, our rituals, everything negative. We killing all of that. We are family now. We building families. Get ready for the biggest family reun reunions you ever seen before. That is pure culture that we are bringing to the continent as Africans. We having family reunions in Africa, diasporans from all over the world, Limbly family. Get ready. Get ready. We're going to do it big. Okay. Hey, Free Sandra Blackburn. Greetings. Cute. Much love to you. Sonia said, Cheryl Root, I see you. No worries. I smashed that like button, like button on my way in. Yes. T Roy, enjoy that good Ethiopian coffee, sir. Cheryl said, Great job on the live with Dwight, the mentor. Have to go back and watch the rest. Had to make it to this live. Yes, Ma, it was a great live. We had an awesome, awesome time as always. Never get a dull moment here and living, living my best life in Ghana. Yes. Mikey Dada said, hey, Jatan Bailey, get them coins, sis. You just better make them residuals. Yes. T-Roy. He going to Ghana, but he got us. He got a pit stop in Ethiopia. Yes. Look now. Y'all making me excited. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> How much more evidence do I do you all need before you decide to leave this place? That's right, Audrey. Yes, we don't need no more. I sh subscribe to the White Dog Mentor, please, everybody. Marie Antoinette. I will buy a one-way ticket to my destination and then add cheapest tickets to another African country on it so I can get into that country. That's how you got to do it. This is it. This is simple information. This is why we are on this live today because sometimes we can't figure this thing out by ourselves. We make it more complicated than it really is by being self-policing. We're not doing that. We're coming up with all the options y'all need right now. How to do this. Ways that Dallas Forest can get passed buying round trip tickets when you are repatriating to Africa. Okay. 
Miss Grace made a valid point. This is a valid point that everybody needs to know. I will buy a one-way ticket to my destination and then add the cheapest ticket to another African country on it so I can get into that country. That's just that simple. Just that simple. Okay? I had another sister that said that she bought a bus ticket from, that showed that she was buying a bus ticket for 30 US dollars from one city uh from uh la, 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 from one country to uh, whatever country that was neighboring to her just to get past that issue you know what i'm saying and she gonna use it too because you can country hop you ain't got to just leave all together you can just go move around a little bit or once you get in the country then you get an extension and you'll be straight but that's what we talking about tonight Thank you, Miss Grace, for that information. I got a five-year visa for Ghana, so they don't ask me about no return flight. Pay $738 for my one-way flight. Quasi, that's awesome, but there is something else. A five-year visa is good. That is for multiple multiple entry. It's, this is different. Okay, let's understand that. We got to talk about this because we need to understand exactly what we're talking about. When you go to Ghana, and I might have to show you this, because uh, I had pulled up some of those. Uh, I probably had to show you, share my screen and show y'all, okay? Uh, what I'm talking about. Prince Kwesi, I, I see what you're saying with the multiple entry visa i have that too but there is a stamp that you get once you enter the country when you get to ghana with your multiple entry visa that's to enter into the country but there is a stamp that they give you when you get there that sometimes they ask you oh when are you leaving you don't have a, a round trip Oh, where are you staying? What what are you doing? What you? Cause your 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 um they they your pass your stamp will last for either thirty days or sixty days. It just depends on which one they give you at the airport. Okay, once you get that stamp, then you home free. You can get extensions while you staying in Ghana. You can get your extension. But if you have a problem with somebody's like, they're not gonna give you that stamp until you show them around or uh, some type of ticket that you're going to be leaving then you might have to come up with a flight or a bus ticket showing that you are going to be leaving going to senegal or going to togo going to benin at a so-and-so so-and-so date not necessary that you got to use it but that's just what, what they might ask you so you might have to buy you a bus ticket in ghana for the vip or the vvip depending on uh which uh travel you use they're showing that you're going to buy a airplane ticket flying to another african country or you might have to show that you are traveling back to uh the uk or back to america on a certain day but there are ways to get around that all right good to hear that i'm from guinea Bissau balanta means those who resist Welcome, bro. That's uh Malika. Uh, yes, sister. Hey, Malika. Yes. All right, Eduardo. What's up with you, Eduardo? Yes, Majo. Congrats, Etiroy. Malika, here is your Mandinka lesson. Good morning. It's La Sam Lisama. Goodbye is Fonyato. Abinyadi is hello. Go on, Dwight the mentor. See, y'all know the white been traveling, hitting these spots up for some time. It's so good to have your greetings down packed from different countries. That is beautiful. Mandinka is good morning. Is Lisama. Goodbye is from Yato. And Abinyadi is hello. Yes, yeah, so Malika. Make sure you write that down, sis. You got it. Hey, Malika, who are you? In my Lion King voice. Now you can answer properly. Yes, queen. Congratulations, love. Oh, my goodness. I'm so happy for you, Malika. I can't wait till the rest of us have gotten our African ancestry done. This is 
epic. They never wanted us to have this type of information. Yes, Anja Africa said, Malika, bless your heart and your ancestors. Ooh, that's powerful. Yes. Yes, this is beautiful, Malika, the uh, savvy entrepreneur said. Oh, yes. Power knows it means sending my love, Katuma Upendo Wangu. Yes, it does. Upenzi. Oh, okay. Yes, this is beautiful. Mandinka people are very athletic and lean and framed. Lean framed. Janet Bolton. Hey, my ancestors are from Sierra Leone and Nigeria. Go, Janet. Congratulations for everybody that know their lineage right now. This is phenomenal. We never knew that we would see this in our lifetime for our African, own African scientists to figure out a way to connect us back to our, our rightful tribes and our homeland directly to where our ancestors stepped foot on. This is phenomenal. Yes, Janet Bolton, congratulations and welcome to living my best life in Ghana. Yes. Over here clapping at the TV. Happy, happy for Malika. Ain't that some Jaton? Cause oh, yes, this is beautiful. A1 baby for life. You hear me? Yes. Ooh, this is beautiful. Wow, Malika. Yes, this is awesome. I'm so happy. Awesome, Malika. No more guessing. Congratulations, sis. That is the piece. That main piece to the puzzle that was left. That's all. Congratulations on that. Put that piece in there, uh, Malika. No more guessing. No wondering where the piece at. Oh, you got it. That's so awesome. I remember. I'm feeling like I'm feeling like I when I got my results. Okay. Bless your heart and bless your ancestors. Ain't that some? Good morning, kings and queens. Let's have a good one. Can't wait for the reunion. Yes, money KB. Okay, we gonna kick it. Yes, we are. Oh, I can't wait. Hey, girl, looking to meet y'all one day in Ghana. Got my passport, working on my visa now. Be ready to come back home. Brenda Felder, keeping it real. Hey, that's right. You got you got your accomplishments. You got it done. Now you are headed home, Aquaba, and welcome to living my best life in Ghana. Yes, we are glad you here. Mortar, mortar. Hey, y'all. We in here. Yes, we are. What a great, beautiful, lively day it is to be African. Mortar, mortar. Oh, Madassi family. If it wasn't for Limblick family, I never would have taken that step. Malika, the ancestors brought us together. We're just excited. And elated and happy for you. This is a blacktastic time right here. Yes, it is. Ghana, 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 baby. Africa, Tanzania, wherever we going, Gambia, we here we come. Uh, who is that? Prince Quasi said, Malika, did you get your results via email? Because I'm gonna be on the continent when my African ancestry results are due. Wow. Melanta people are very good in math, Eduardo said. Hey, Malika said, cry by new Limblick family. If you're looking for a channel to laugh till you cry, hear black love stories, need motivation to exit this Babylon and see your mother laying in a positive light. Bam, bam, you have arrived. You sure have. A cry by and welcome. All right, I got my passport working. I'm getting my visa. I'm ready to come home. Okay. Yen coffee. We let's go home, family. Prosperity, peace, and power, my sister Sandra. Haral is in the house. Much love to you. Much prosperity, peace, and power right back at you. Okay, I receive it and I send it right back. Daya Salam to Kampala by bus. It's $25 and 12 hours. See there? From Daya Salam to Kampala. $25 for a 12 hour trip. We ain't gonna have no problems. Zola, y'all, Okima. Kwaba family, such a beautiful union. Yes, it is. Fire. It's beautiful. I'm a former flight attendant, was thinking about doing a video on this. I'm excited to have found yours instead. 
Erica Childs, much love to you. Just look, email me. You can come on here whenever you want to and disseminate whatever information you have to offer the family. We appreciate you. We love our people that do this for us, that really disseminate information. This is beautiful. Appreciate you, Erica Childs. Thank you for being here with us. You are welcome. Akwaba. Welcome to the family, y'all. Make sure y'all go back into the archives. Watch our videos so y'all can learn about the family here. We are a big family. We love African people here. African people is our focus. We are African Center and we demand peace and freedom. Okay. Yes. Hello, my limb blade family. Every day something happens in this country that tells us we don't need to be here. So let's go and build our paradise. Well said, bro, bro. HDMC in the house. And it ain't nothing going to hold us back. We're going to go home and make magic together. Come on, y'all. Malika said, Prince, yes, this they sent through the email. And they let you know via email within 24 to 36 hours before it will be delivered. That's awesome. Receiving your results in Mama Africa. Ain't that something? That is awesome, y'all. Y'all got me so happy over here. <laughs> I'm so happy over here. Yes. Yes. Congratulations, uh, Queen Malika Muhammad. Yes, Queen. Yes, Malika. Yes, yes, yes. I got two thumb two two months before I go December the fourth was my great grandmama and closest cousin who the police killed birthday. My, I'm bringing them both with me. We going to Ghana and we acting up. You better just go there. You just better go there. Bring them ancestors with you. Make that circle back to the homeland. Y'all, y'all is doing a whole lot, boy. We are doing so much more than we realize. But we talking about it because we got to realize this power that we got going on. I do not understand how to go about this one-way ticket, Queen. We got you, MWH Boutique. Yes. Writing it down now. Uh, Berenda Felder, keeping it real. How long did they say you will get it back? Are you in the USA? Miss Grace wanted to know. Yes, Malika, congratulations. Aquaba, Janet, congrats. Sis, yes. Where do you get this information, Charles Kelly from many sources? Y'all, all you got to do is research it when you find it out. Research it for yourself. I am very sad about what is going on about America against Black people. And my little advice to our people, they should try as much as possible to return to Africa. Yes, greetings, family. Hey, Frank, how are you? Mada said. Sonia said, waiting for my ancestral results next month. Would like to wait and announce my results live. You are so welcome. We would appreciate it. We would love to share that with you. Yes. No, and T. Roy said that Malika, don't that results make you walk taller, family? I'm telling you, y'all back straight. Ugh, ugh, ugh. <laughs> Just feel good about yourself. Just great about yourself. Yes, congratulations. Wow. It's in order. Hey, Marty Mark. Much love. Much love to you, everybody. Congrats, congrats, congrats. Yes. I yes. That means yes. Uh-huh. So do walk high and proud. Hello, Marty Mark Zola said. All right, y'all. Let's do this. Let's get them likes up. XDMC is on it tonight. All right. So, all right, United States of America is imploding nonstop, okay? Peace, family. Would you recommend Visa on arrival or get it before you leave? I, if you got some time, I definitely would recommend you do visas before you get to Ghana, before you get to wherever country you're going, because it's more economical and you can get multiple entry. Like, Ghana has the multiple entry visa. Five years. Some of the consulates only do three years. If you're going to do the multiple entry visa, make sure you mail your visa to Houston, Texas address. The Ghana consulate in Houston, Texas. Okay. Make sure you do that for your multiple entry visa. Now the visa 
And the stamp that I'm talking about tonight is different. Your visa, you can get a multiple entry visa before you get to Ghana, okay? You can get that multiple entry visa. That means that you can enter and exit the country. You can enter the country as many times as you would like to for five years, or if it's for three years, you can enter the country for as many times as you want to for three years, okay? But I definitely recommend you, if you got some time to go ahead and do it before you leave, I also recommend if you do it, because I have done this several times um, for many, many reasons, had to purchase multiple entry visas down through the years. And the last time we went, we had to get a visa on arrival. OK, that was easy. Uh, it was costly. OK, because what I paid for one entry visa for seventy five dollars, I could have paid twenty five more dollars and had a multiple entry visa a multi-entry visa, okay, for five years. So I don't know if the, the Ghana taking the price back up, but during the year return, it was $150 for the visa on arrival. They cut it in half and, and they was doing it for $75 for the year return. Now, what that price is right now, I don't know. But if you do have time before it's time for you to get out of here, I definitely recommend you get your visa early get your visa early before you leave the country okay if you have had your passport for a while make sure your passport is not going to expire within the next six months because if it does they will not allow you to travel check your passports if you are an africa traveler or if you have traveled if you had a passport for some time because you go on cruises all the time or you go to jamaica barbados or grenada Cuba or somewhere uh, all the time, make sure you check your visa, okay? Your uh, passport that is not about to expire because if it does, you're going to have a hard time that you do not want to have. Make sure you go ahead and reapply for your passport. Queen Mermaid said, my predominant DNA is Ghana. My ancestors are Kana, Sante, Ga, and Zima, and Airway. Wow! Queen Mermaid, that is awesome! Congratulations. That is so great to have that, all of that ancestry that you can take hold to that's running through your DNA memory bank. All your ancestors is coming together and you taking them back home. Yes, thanks. No problem, Janet. Yes. At T. Roy, when you get there, be sure to show out for the ancestors. Safe travels and much love when you go. The savvy entrepreneur said, "Peace and love, and my sister, uh, sister Audrey XDMC, sunshine and rain gardening." Said Kwaba family, "Hey, much love to you. Welcome back." Marty Mar said, "Hello, Zola, and thanks." Start healing your body from the inside out. Get those power packs for all your herbs and tonics. We buy black.com forward slash nappy by nature. Let's support our own. Let's do it. Black Karen said eight days to Tanzania. Black Karen, our super shero, is on her way home. Much love to you. Much love, Marcus Taliba. Greetings, bro, bro. Hello, all giving thanks to the most half for blessings. Yes, much love to you. Much love, much love, Marcus. I live in Houston. Go on, bro, bro. It's time to get back home. My traveling buddy. That's me and pal traveling buddy right there. All right, Keisha said to Erica Childs, I knew someone with the same name in, in HS, Aquaba. Welcome to the group. Yes, much love, Erica Childs. Okay. Yes. And Marie said at MWH Boutique, either you'll pay one year or multiple entry for three to five years. It'll save you money. It sure will. I so needed this conversation two weeks ago, but I worked it out and got a decent round trip ticket on Kenya Airways for just under three months for $783. That's awesome, my body, Africa. That is awesome. Wow, that is great. Kenya Air is doing it. Black Karen, the countdown is set. Congratulations, Ma Kelly said. Yes. 
Marty Mark said future does that fire stick work in Ghana. Thanks. Yes, it does. It sure does. It does. It does. All you got to do is make sure you have your VPN. All right. We already talked about that VPN. If y'all don't understand what that is, what it is, you need to watch our video about VPNs. It's very good information that everybody should have. Okay. Yes, that, that fire stick works fine. So he said, King Power seat is vacant. Has the king left already to sit on his throne and gonna already? Oh, wait. He must be getting his random acts of flyness, African flyness, African royalty drip flyness together. <laughs> Sonia, he in the kitchen, baby. Salads on deck and smoothies. Coming soon. All right, Erica said it. Keisha, thank you. I have come across a few others on social media as I've gotten older. I found out how unoriginal my parents were. Oh, sorry. All right. I always talked about Sierra Leone to my kids. Didn't know uh, at this time. My people was from there. My son took his call, called me and told me we were from there. I was so happy because... That gives us that they do give citizenship, Sierra Leone. They give citizenships with that paperwork. <laughs> Janet, that is beautiful. Congratulations. Okay, Sonovia said also make sure your passport book is not full. Yes, your pages. They got the new books, the new large books now with the uh, more pages because people are traveling. And they didn't do that for us, but it's good that we can get in on to get them big pages, them big passport books where we can get multiple stamps. Because some people, they don't care where they stamp you at, and they just be taking up all the room, okay? Ashe says, a Kwaba family, Ashe. I'm so excited for you, Black Karen. Frank said, multiple visa is very good, but my wishes is to go to Africa without visa. I hope one day it will be done, so it will. It will, Frank. The more and more of us going home, uh, it's some countries that don't even require us to have visas. Okay, so Wubona, my people, love y'all. You are important. Yes, you are too, miscellaneous. Aquaba, thank you for all the love, everyone. My spirit needs this family, and my heart is full. Much love to you, Erica Child. Come on, child. You got it. Bonjour, Diaspora. Much love. King Shuja is in the house. TV. What's up, y'all? Live from the kitchen. <laughs> Power said, what's up, y'all? He live from the kitchen. All right. Congrats at Mind Body Africa and Black Karen. See you sisters on the ground soon. Yes. Saul Bona. Yes. I let him say that how he want to say it. Yes. We all got the large passport book. That's great. Okay. Let's talk about these ways that diasporans can get past buying a round trip ticket when you are repatriating to Africa. I've been checking out a few people that said they're coming up ways with ways to get it done. There's a lot of people not planning on coming back. They want them one way tickets. Okay, and they are economical. Okay, it's time for us to be looking for our tickets, looking for our to get ourselves back home to the mama to mama Africa. It is time for us to do that. Okay. Let's see. I called Houston on Tuesday and the cost for multiple entry with the rush service is 200 Yes, yeah, so the extra hundred dollars for the rush and the application is processed and mailed back to you the next day. Good for three years. Okay. Houston, they gone to three years. That's where I used to get my five year visa from. Okay. Salute power. Yes. Audrey says salute power. Audrey. I'll be on the ground. November 11. <laughs> Ooh, that's beautiful. That is so beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Best at one. 12 watching 112 likes. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah, babe. Yes, much love, much love to all of y'all. Let's get on this tip about this uh stamp. Okay, remember the visa 
Let me see if I can pull this up too. Because I already looked it up once and I had it on here, but it has gotten away. So I want to make sure that y'all have what y'all need. Let's see, do I see it here? Mm-hmm. Let's see if I can just see. Mm. Okay. I just want y'all to see the difference between the visa uh the visa going to immigration. I want y'all to see the difference between the visa and the stamp. Okay, I get it. All right. Now, let me share my screen because I want y'all to see this. All right, right here. Okay. Now, this inf this uh information that I'm going to share with you about this this stamp is very important that y'all understand that there is a difference between the visa, which is the visa on arrival which Ghana says they have opened back up where you can get the visa on arrival and the, the stamp. The stamp is what gives you how much time you have to spend in the country before you have to either go get an extension or leave, or they say that you are there illegally. Okay. Okay. So make sure you understand the difference. There is a difference. The difference is... Let me see if I can just put this up here really big. Over here on the right, these stamps on here, when you arrive in Ghana, an uh, immigration officer, once you turn in your immigration form, that form, I'll show you what that form looks like. It's over here on the left, all the way to the left. But as far as the stamp was what we're talking about, how you can get past we're buying a round trip ticket because a lot of us want to get one way tickets. And sometimes in immigration, they won't give you this stamp unless you can show them that you are going to be returning or going somewhere else after your time has expired, which is on this stamp. This stamp on the right hand side, this is what this stamp looks like. And when they open your passport, they will stamp your, your passport showing that whatever the date is, when you arrive, you have either 30 days or 60 days from that date to spend that time in Ghana. But if you decide that you want to stay, then you have to go to immigration before. This expiration date is, is ended or you would be out of way more money than you would be if you had to just went early, a week early, go a week early. Okay, don't wait till the last minute. Go a week or two early and get your extension at the immigration office back at the airport. Don't go nowhere else. <laughs> don't go nowhere else make sure you go back to the airport to get your extension take you and your children your husband your wife or whichever one take everybody's passport to the airport pay 50 gonna see this this how much it's gonna be if you do it before expiration if you do it after expiration ain't no telling what you gonna get at what what you gonna have to pay i'm telling you so please do not take this lightly. This is a, a way to get some money. 
This is a way to get some money up out of you. You never wanted to have. You don't want to experience this. We have done this already. We have experienced this already. Okay. Unfortunately, yeah, some people use that against you. Or oh, you don't have a round trip. It just depends on what immigration officer that you are. You have to ha happen to run into. Okay. Some people don't go through this. But some people, you get the, the immigration officer that's just like, oh, I got to make some, I got to make some off of this. I need the babies need new shoes. Blase, blase. You American, you can get more. Uh, give me something, or or you will not enter. They will hold you, make you seem like, oh my God, and you just be like, I ain't got no more. Some people be like, look, I ain't got no more money. I don't have, I don't have no more money. I got a uh, hundred CDs. I can give you a hundred CDs. I don't have nothing else. It just depends. But this is what we talking about. The round trip tickets. That's why we have always had round trip tickets. And now the tickets are very economical. You can get round way. I mean, a round trip ticket and you can change your tickets for no charge on most airlines. You, it just depends on who you flying with. Okay. So this is what you have to keep in mind because we've seen this. Now I've had a sister, you know, a brother, somebody that says, well, I don't have, uh, they said, well, you can't, we won't give you uh, a stamp until you can show us uh, uh, some other ticket of movement out of this country. So they went to their phone, they got online, they bought them a ticket from Ghana to so-and-so, so-and-so, from Tanzania to, you know, um, whatever the neighboring countries is or wherever you can go, you can just buy a ticket showing that. You don't necessarily have to go, but you got to show them that, okay? This is, this is something that's been happening regularly that's why I don't want nobody to be alarmed, to be shocked, to be wondering what's going on. Why y'all doing me like this? A lot of people have been complaining about this happening to them. And I don't want y'all to be nowhere without knowing what to do. So this is why I'm showing you this. This stamp, once again, on the right is the stamp that I'm talking about. It does not have anything to do with your visa per se. This is the stamp that you get and the amount of time you get to stay in the country. 30 days, 60 days. And then if you plan on being there, then you you might want to go ahead and apply for your residency or you just, you know, just stay there. And when you leave, you just pay a penalty or whatever. It just depends on the person. I mean, but it's a way to do this always. If you're going to deal with immigration, go back to the airport. Do not deal with immigration outside of the airport because you're going to end up paying some more money when you get back there. Okay. So that's what you need to know. This is the information that I needed to share with y'all when it comes to that stamp is different from your visa. Let me see. Some people have not seen the visa before. I want to go and show you what that visa looks like as well. Okay. Um, Let's see. The visa, which is what you will get. You will have to send your uh, passport in to the Ghana consulate. And this is what you will receive uh, on your passport. This is what the visa looks like. Okay, this is what the visa looks like. You see the Republic of Ghana, the third one, or the first one, second, third. This is what the visa looks like. Um, on, on when they uh, send your passport back on one of your pages, 
inside of your passport, you will have a sticker that looks like this. This is what the visa looks like. And this visa means that you can enter the country however much time they put on that visa or what you pay for. If you pay for a single entry, I think that's $50. $50 for a single entry. Uh, if you pay for a multiple entry visa, I believe that's $100 for a three to five year visa, depending on the consulate. Okay. But the uh, thing I liked about the Houston uh, consulate is because they send you your visa back fast. Okay. Your passport and your visa comes back really really fast if you want more information as far as the visa process go how it works make sure y'all go back into the archives and watch the video on the visa i'm gonna try my best to put it in the description box where you can just click on it about the process with the visa and getting your visas um once you get your passports in you send your uh passport to uh the consulate, the Ghana consulate in Houston, in DC, uh, in New York, whichever one you send it to. But my recommendation is to send it to Houston because they understand the meaning of rush. Okay. They understand it. Some, some companies say they, they are send your rush visa. You pay for extra for, for a rush and they don't send it for two weeks. They have sent mine back so fast, like three days or two days, like two days. I was like, I must have mailed myself this information back to me. I was shocked that it came back so fast. Okay. And I normally send the overnight prepaid envelope for them. When they finish processing my visa, they put it in that overnight envelope that I sent all the paperwork, my passports, my passport pictures, the application in the envelope. I prepay for the overnight at the post office. I put that inside of there and then I seal it. I overnight that to them. And then uh, when they process it, they might get it the next, when they get it back the next day, they process it that day, call me and like, oh, we finished processing and they send it back and I got it back the next day. Just that quick. So yeah, it really, really works. All right. Let's see here. So yes, I want y'all to have this information. And if y'all have any questions, let's go with some questions. Power now we have to we have to do some serious packing. So we're not some nights we're not gonna take hold y'all as long because we got we're coming down into the time crunch. This month is gone by so fast, and we got some work on our hands that we gotta do. So once I get off here, I got some packing and some cleaning and some gathering things for wash, throw away, everything. So I'm going to be up about two more hours or so after this so I can get some things done, okay? All right. Uh-huh. Come on, y'all. Five days to woke, okay? Y'all, y'all, baby, you been counting woke that time down. We got five days to woke, fam. Yo, lay. Yes, we excited about woke. Y'all don't know what woke is? Please go back into the archives last month on the 28th or before to get you uh, up to uh, speed as far as woke is concerned. You got to send your actual passport. Yes, and they're going to send it right back to you. But the difference is it's going to have a visa inside of it, the savvy entrepreneur. God is within. South Santa Sana, you are so welcome. Good night, African kings and queens. Hey, say 3131. Yes, the actual passport. Thanks a bunch. I wasn't aware I would have any trouble just purchasing a one-way ticket to the Gambia. Now, I mean, 
I don't know about the Gambia. I'm talking about Ghana. Uh, but some people have been saying they've been having some issues. If you do, it's no big deal. You know what you got to do to resolve it. Okay. You, somebody might not ask you for a, a return ticket. They might not ask you. If they do, you just go ahead and research right now how to purchase you a ticket. If you in the Gambia, if you need to go to a neighboring country or you want to go to another place, you can go there. I mean, you can buy your ticket somewhere cheap. All right. Yes. Army in Sierra Leone in November. Dwight says that Janet already have contact. Follow my friend Abraham at Monday Lessons at Sierra Leone Culture on YouTube. He is a friend of ES Eat Love Migrate. All right. We'll follow him. I would love to give me some men day lessons. Greetings, Edwin. Nilante Thompson. Yo, greetings. Hello, family. Hey, bro, bro. How you doing? Uh-huh. Dwight, can you provide any information on Visa in Tanzania? Audrey said. Yes, buy a refundable return ticket. Live now, live free. Okay. I always purchase insurance on my stuff. I mean, my insurance paid off for me last time, okay, during this whole uh, corona, this whole pandemic thing. Okay, it pays to have insurance. Hello, kings and queens, Africa, here I come. So the visa permit entry and the stamp tells you how long you are in the country. Yes, the visa uh, is the entry. I can enter with th for three years as much as I want to enter. I can enter the country. The stamp tells you how long you have, the duration of time that you have to be, be in the country before you actually have to go and get an extension at the airport. Only deal with immigration at the airport. I cannot reiterate that enough. If you have an issue and you need to go to immigration, make sure you go to the airport, please. Word of Ministries said peace and blessings. Greetings. Word of Ministries is in the house. Greetings to you, Aquaba, and welcome to Living My Best Life in Ghana. Yes. Marine Sam said, hey, family. Power in there cooking vittles. Yes, Lorraine Sam, he is. He's saying hi on here too, y'all. He's, he's checking in, but he in the kitchen. Jatan said, okay, so if I'm traveling to Ghana, then to Gambia, do I need a visa to get into Gambia as well? Yes. Yep, yep, yep. That's the thing about it. When you're traveling to different countries, you have to have your visas. Go ahead and get your visas now. It's better to work proactively than defensively, okay? Go ahead and get your visas now if you know you're going to be traveling to Gambia. Love to travel with Wave. Greetings, just passing through. Greetings, love to travel with Wave. Okay, much love to you. Aquaba, welcome. Houston got my visa back in four days. Rich King. Yes, Rich King said he got his back in four days. I don't know if you did the overnight, Rich King, but that's a little trick that I use uh, to get my visa back. And it may be because they were behind or they had to close down due to the pandemic. So it could, huh? Uh-huh. Ask Dwight, is there a Tanzanian embassy in the U.S.? Is there a Tanzanian embassy in the U.S., uh, Dwight? Cheryl said, Houston is very responsive. Responsive. Answered the phone on the second ring. I tried calling New York three times, was on hold 30 minutes each time, then was disconnected when it was my turn. Yep. Thank you, Cheryl. That's the truth. The, uh, the uh, uh, Houston Gunner constantly called me on the phone, said, look, we just finished processing your, your visa. We putting your visa in the mail today. Oh. The mailman to be here in an hour. Oh, okay. I got my visa. I got my passports back the following day. 
It was two days before my travel date. I was so nervous and it came back. There was one time I was just totally happy. And, and Houston has been the only constantly, I have to say that I had the best experience with. I've dealt with New York. I had to stay over in New York because my visa had expired and they didn't catch it. I didn't know they didn't catch it. So the Delta Airlines had to put us up in the hotel and Powell stayed with me. He was like, my wife ain't going nowhere without me. So y'all got to put both of us together and reschedule both of us for the next evening. We had to get up. It was cold, snowing, it was cold weather. I don't think it was snowing. It's cold weather. Okay. And we had to get up the next morning, find our way to Manhattan, to the office early, be there to drop our visas off early that day, that morning, get passport pictures. Come back in the afternoon after lunch to pick up the passports with the visa stamp in it. The, it was it was just a horrible experience for me. Okay, that's why y'all got to make sure you check your paperwork, check your stamp. When you get your stamp, when they stamp your your uh passport page, look at your stamp and see how much time they get you. Ask them for 60 days. If you get, have somebody nice for immigration, ask them, can you get a 60 day instead of 30 day? You know what I'm saying? Or how can you get a six months? Ask people. Ask, gun, ask the, ask the uh, immigration officer. Okay. Hey, Audrey. Audrey said, Jaton, I believe you can get your visa upon arrival to be safe. Yes. You could just call the DC office. God is within, said Mind Body Africa. Are you going to Kenya? In order to get your visa, Heart and Soul 143, did you have to provide a date when you would be traveling? Uh, I'm trying to see, did I provide my itinerary? Yes, I think I provided my a copy of my itinerary. But I don't think that it's necessary. They'll ask you what date are you intending to travel. But I don't think that you have to have it when you uh, send in your application. But make sure you check the instructions to see. Because I don't think that it's mandatory that you have to have it uh, before you can get your visa. Okay. My body Africa said just laying over en route to Ghana. Okay, Ghana is final destination. Now, I don't think if you land over from that country that you will have to have a visa. That's just my thought. I I don't I don't recall when we went to Togo, Benin, we never had a visa. Because we never left the airport. That's right. So uh if you stop in these places do not leave outside the airport if you do you need to make sure that you don't have to have a visa if you do need to have a visa you need to plan uh to get one while you in the airport you can go to the immigration office inside the airport and get the visa that you need yes please info on tanzania visa and what's up with the e-visa option Okay. Greetings from California. Joyce Boggs in the house. Yo. Hey, Joyce. Don't think you're getting around with no visa. I learned that it was epic. Okay. New York Embassy, terrible service. Rich King. That's why I tell everybody go through Houston. Hello from Los Angeles. Strange Fruit is in the house. Hey, Strange Fruit. All right. <laughs> Bill Lawrence, I was told Gambia is not doing visa on arrival right now. I sent my passport to DC. It's two hundred dollars. Okay. Is that for the ex is that for, for the expedited visa and multiple entry bill? New York MC is horrible. Why do they still have jobs? Rich King, this <laughs> Rich King, listen to me. <laughs> I mean, uh, strange fruit at Rich King. Let me tell you something. 
These are Ghana embassies or Ghana consulates in America. It's not about jobs. It's just how some people do business in different ways. It's unfortunate. Some people feel like they ain't never got to be in a hurry, like it's not important or whatever. Some people feel like they do need to uh, cater to the clients to make sure that's that's a Ghana embassy or Ghana consulate, okay? Okay, Queen Mermaid said, D.C. consulate does a good job as well. Um, I've had, I've tried to call the consulate in D.C. before. Um, the turnaround time was not good for me. Turnaround time. Okay, Audrey said it, Bill. Thank you for the update. The price has gone up. Yeah. Hi, host Lizzie. Vincent TV channel. Hey, greetings. How are you? Aquaba, welcome. Hello, everyone. Hello, Lizzie Vincent TV channel. Much love, Aquaba. Ayo Flea said, it's time to repatriate, y'all. They keep killing us. Protesting does nothing. It does something. It's showing some type of resistance, but expecting uh, the Pink Panthers and the race soldiers to stop doing what they doing, it's time for us to go home. This is the reason why you must get dual citizenship in Africa to avoid these visa issues. In some countries that are working on this, there are people that's getting their citizenship with their African ancestry DNA results. And there are other people that is getting their citizenship by going through being a resident for some time and getting um getting citizenship that way. So, I mean, it just depends on where you want to fall in at, y'all. Cheryl Ruth said that Rich King, yes, they on strike, I guess. Shaking my head. Most definitely, Frank. I'm planning on having dual citizenship. I'm planning on going to Africa next summer. Gone. Ayo, flee. Hey, Ayo, flee. Greetings. Yes, good, Ayo, Frank said. Infinite Mama for it, Bill. How long before you got your visa back? I just got here, so Uncle Jay sending positive vibes to all my family. Special greetings to the new family members. Yes, Uncle Jay. Expedited cost two seventy five. It's a thirty day visa. Not sure if that's multiple entry. Who? All right, you. That's the details that you need to find out about. Uh, bill expedite cost two seventy five. You pay two hundred. It's a thirty day visa, and you need to see if that's a multiple entry visa or what exactly that is that you have paid for for two hundred dollars. Okay, anybody else? Um, I don't think Sherry is here. She could probably tell us about the um her visa experience with Tanzania. So, uh, but either way, y'all do your due diligence, research, make phone calls to these embassies. I don't know if there is a Tanzania uh, embassy in the United States. And you might have to uh, check it out online. As a matter of fact, I'm going to get off of here and check out some things myself uh, before I start this packing. But it's very important information and it's very important that we uh, do our research, okay? Wow. And Bill, my visa was for a year and I paid less. If you do the ancestry, how long until you get your citizenship? It just depends on what country, who's doing citizenship, who you find out is certain countries that are given citizenship because of your African ancestry uh, results. Sierra Leone is one of them. Uh, I know brother got his uh, from Nigeria because of his results. A lot of uh, celebrities and people have gotten their citizenship because of their results. So it just depends, but it's something that you should definitely have to take along with you to uh, for your paperwork. This is the only paperwork that I really endorse. Uh, Dwight Demento said, Audrey, Tanzania, 
had it on a ravel for a hundred and seventy five dollars. And was that was that a one a single entry or was it multiple entry? My goodness. But like I said, shoot, Ghana had they uh visa on the rounds for 150, but for the year return, they had slashed it in half. And when I came back from Ghana after I got that year return, I went in, I went we went to Ghana on 2000 in 2019. And we received our uh Ghana up uh, our visa on arrival in Ghana, and it was seventy five dollars. They had one hundred and fifty slash seventy five for your return. That's what they had on on the wall uh over there where you get the visas done. Okay, so one seventy five, one fifty. Yes, that's a lot of money. Last question. So Malika can get her citizenship in Senegal and avoid the visa. If Senegal gives people their citizenship with their uh, African ancestry results, yes. If she becomes a Senegalese uh, citizen, then she will not have to get a visa any longer. Okay. She will not have to get a visa. Anybody that becomes a citizen do not have to pay visa fees anymore. You take your passport, you take your uh, Ghana passport, your Senegalese passport, you use it when you're coming back to Africa, you use your American passport when you headed back to America. Okay? Just that simple. Hard to get a live person. They are still working limited hours due to COVID, see? Are you in Sierra Leone? It's 30 days to get citizenship with proof of African ancestry documents. What? In Sierra Leone. Wow, that's amazing. Miss Minnesota Snow, the pop one, said it's Dwight. I have a one-hour layover in Kilimanjaro before going into Dar. Do I get the visa in Kilimanjaro or Dar? I heard Tanzania only was $100. Okay, I paid $100 for multiple entry visa for one year. Okay. Okay, Uncle Jarvis, you did that. Where did you get that visa from is it a consulate a, a tanzania consulate in america you got your visa on the raffle and how does the stamp work do you have a stamp uncle jarvis that they stamped for you when you got in the country check your passport for that future 30 days tanzania okay so it's 30 days for the stamp in tanzania Thanks a lot, Dwight. I'm taking my African ancestor ASAP. <laughs> Miss Minnesota, Kilimanjaro is in Tanzania, so you can get it there. Awesome. Good information. Good information for the family. But you all still do your research, do your due diligence, so you will know all the answers. Take your time, research, read, do your work for yourself like a project. Okay, so you won't get caught up for any reason. Okay, Dwight said, I stand corrected. If Unc said it's $100, also I heard it's cheaper for seniors. Okay, good good job. I heard in Senegal they don't care about citizenship through RJ Mahi. He said they get the same privileges as a citizen. All right, well, there you have it. Uh, these are uh, people's tips. And gems, uh, you still need to research and do the work uh, yourself to make your feel your make yourself feel comfortable. Uh, this is just information that you know that you can go and get. You can work against that or work in your behalf. Okay. Okay. Dwight said, "Walk with some cash, y'all." Okay. Thank you, now. Got to know these things. Uncle Jobs said, I got a visa on the route. Yes, they stamped it at the airport. They have a special residence visa if you're 60 and above. Oh, wow. That's awesome, Uncle Jay. 
Okay, Marine Sam. Uh, if uh, the white puts it on, he's on uh, Essentials, Essentials TV show on IG or Facebook. Okay, and what is it? Local Films GA on IG too. And he's on YouTube. Make sure you go over and subscribe to our brother, uh, Dwight, on his channel, okay? Yes, Unc, I remember. Pops came with me in the, in the first time, and he went to a special line. What? That's what's up. Man, that's nice. Tanzania. Now, I know I haven't heard about that in Ghana, but that's good to know that they have a special, you know, a special uh, uh, line for uh, elders to come through and they can get citizenship. Okay. Well, special residence visa. Okay. Because that's different from citizenship. That's like a step right before you get your citizenship okay this is the white's information y'all make sure y'all support our brother all right king shoe job tv said me and katuka x uh b1 gabonese twins and we moving back for good. Still waiting on our citizenship. Africa first in my Katuko X voice. Oh, congratulations. That is beautiful. So happy for y'all. Much love, much love. Congratulations again. Africa said greetings, fam. Fire. Much love to Africa. Elders are treated with respect on the continent. Yes. I just found out about the visa for seniors. All you have to do is prove your income, and that's it. Five hundred and fifty U.S. dollars. Man, that's awesome! Smash that like button, family. Come on, y'all. Let's get them likes up before we get out of here. I hope everybody understands. Uh, the information that flowed over here, some great information, some things that we need to know, okay? Some great things that we need to know about this repatriation experience. We need to know, we need to make sure that we uh, have all the information we need. Frank said, African leaders must be granting more citizenship to our brothers and sisters. I thought the only country in Africa have done it a bit well is Ghana. Now, uh, it's more and more countries starting to do it. Miss Minnesota Snow, the pop one, said, Uncle Jarvis, how long did it take for you to go through the visa on arrival process? Now, that visa on arrival process didn't take more than 20 minutes uh, in Ghana, but uh, probably was that amount for Uncle Jarvis. Thanks, brother. One Africa. Yes, King Shuja. Ms. Laney said, you all are best reps for us in Africa. We need that image and that citizenship. Yes. Treat our seniors right. Fire. Great info, fam. Shannon's joy. Thanks, Future. Cash out, please. Cash out is, is, uh, is, uh, is in the description box. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me see. What is my cash app? Uh, oh, okay. Oh, um, uh, let me see. Let me see. I want to make sure that I wasn't leaving anything out. This was a good live. It only took maybe 15 minutes, Uncle Jarvis said. Okay. Jacobo Kaya. Tanzania, you can get visa on arrival. Thank you, Jacobo. 
Much love. I just love how we can sure share information. Don't it's just wonderful. And Uncle Jarvis, you might not have realized, but thank you for that tidbit about my little king out there feeling himself. Respect. <laughs> All right, that is our cash up, y'all. If you want to donate to the cause, to our endeavors. Uh, to our content, and we are going to be country hopping soon, so we will be uh, raising some funds for the country hop, and we're going to be going live from these countries, and we're looking forward to sharing that with our people that's playing on going places. We want recommendations, too, on where should we go. And here burning high power. Is burning in the kitchen. Thank you, Queen Future. I'm ready. You ready to know you. But that's it, Pop, for all the info, fam. Miss Minnesota, Snow, the Pop One, you are so welcome. No problem. Yes. This information you are getting is priceless. Pay the lady, Future. Thank you so much, Dwight. I appreciate it. LOL, at Power. You heard that, T Roy. Not my mama's biscuits at Power. <laughs> Power got me jumping up thinking my house on fire. Mom Kelly said, <laughs> my thoughts on everything. Yo, what's up, my thoughts on everything? What's up, bro, bro? Y'all make sure y'all go over to my thoughts on everything. Share the love, bro. Got a channel. I'm looking forward to all of our family members here starting their own YouTube channel. Now's the time. Do not wait till you get on the continent. Our people need to see us in real time in America in uk wherever we are making our transition it makes it more replicable it makes it more tangible it makes it more doable when our people can see us in our process okay we don't have cash up in europe do you have another way so i can support sure i have paypal yes i'm looking forward to us Starting our own YouTube channel, everyone. All right. Thank you. I just received a cash um, donation from somebody. Probably Dwight. Appreciate you, bro, bro. And I appreciate everybody that's contributing to the fam. Okay. My thoughts on everything. I went to a marketing gunner, but don't remember the name. But they had so many different seasonings on list seasonings. Yes. Audrey, where are me, jerk cassava? Yes. Thank you. You are so welcome. No problem. Bumbalaya. Welcome back, guys. Greetings to the Prince of Mandinka Empire, all, a.k.a. Molly Empire. Evening, Barra. Much love, greetings, and welcome back. Keisha said, Madasi Pasta is the future for this awesome live. Very valuable information. No problem. That's our PayPal. Nappy spelled with the I B Y nature at yahoo.com. Yes. Yes, jerk cassava. <laughs> Saute Brussels sprouts and mushroom braised with jerk sauce. Yes, yes, y'all. Power, you showing out in there? Okay, I'm going to get off this live so I can eat. Sonovia, my thoughts on everything is very knowledgeable, ain't it? Love him. And hot pepper suits, the white said. Hot pepper. Power said he going to make some of that tomorrow, the white. Had to bring you a bowl. Uh, I think we're going to do a pop-up this weekend to uh have us a nice little meet and greet uh for everybody in the atl area uh i'll probably do official announcement tomorrow you have to be in the soft talk group uh offline support group uh to get the information we're not gonna post that up anywhere here uh, you got to be in the offline support group. You got to be building with the family to do the meet and greet. Okay. So if you're interested, you go to Soft Talk uh, and download Soft Talk off of uh, the uh, app, Apple Store or you can go to the Play Store. You download uh, the Soft Talk Messenger app and then 
you register. After you register, you send me an email, living my best life in Ghana at gmail.com. Okay. And send me your number in that email. Put soft talk in the subject, and I will add you to our offline support group. We have a beautiful exchange all the time offline. This very supportive group. I love the group. I love it. I'm paying attention, watching, commenting. We have a ball outside of YouTube. YouTube. We have a life outside of YouTube. Okay. So make sure y'all uh, join our offline support group. Okay. And uh, uh, I just said, Dwight, you making me hungry now. Now cut it out, Dwight. Queen Future, you on fire. Thank you, Mommy Wata, Queen Mermaid. Power bet not come on talking about God love you because ain't no party when it's just one. I'm just saying. <laughs> he coming. I made some shoot and kill soup yesterday. No more congestion. Ho, oh, some shoot and kill soup. Oh, my goodness. Maki Dada. My thoughts on everything. Yes, much love to you. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. Was that senior visa for Tanzania or Ghana? That was a residential permit. Yes, it's for Tanzania. I say, hey, hey, Audrey. LOL. Yo, have said my thoughts on everything. Viva la be vegan. Yes. Yes, bro. That's where we come. We we going to hit it together. Okay. Y'all, make sure y'all be in the live in the morning. We will be officially announcing. Power, quit throwing your arms up every time you make that. What is going on? Did you turn the fan on in there? I know you roasting and roasting. You know our uh, little smoke detector don't like no. This is a bougie smoke detector. Don't like no burning, no little blackening or nothing. This is a bougie smoke detector. All right. Yo. Future, please have a women's retreat next summer. Where you want me to do it at? Dwight? Jamaica? Okay. I can do that, uh, Dwight. Just let me, look, we'll talk about that this weekend. Yes. All right, y'all. Pal, can you come and say hey to the family? What's up, peoples? What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, which peoples? Mm -hmm. Pal, we in the house, y'all. I've been working today, y'all. I was I was really out of it, but I still had to keep functioning. So I had to cook a little something, 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 something. Pal, check your email. I sent you an email a few days ago. Okay, I sure will, my brother. I sure will. All right, you I might sure have will. to send to live my best life in Ghana at gmail.com to make sure he get it. All right. God love you. Hold on. Guess what you told me to come with. Tell Jaja we miss his. Hey, everybody. He at home tonight. <laughs> he ain't even here. Because Nana said uh, we'll see him tomorrow. Okay, I'm missing my homeboy. God is within. Say, so will they stamp it for 30 days? If you return the ticket, is it 90 days? I don't think so. God is within. I think they shorten it for some reason so they make more money on the extension. T Roy, what's up, man? I see. Salute, OG. What's up? What's up? I had to come in and say hey. All right, y'all. We're going to get out of here. We love y'all. We'll see y'all in the morning. We already got the schedule for tomorrow. So, hey, power. God love you. God love me.